everyone. Thanks for tuning in. I'm Terry. I am a curl specialist and I also have curly hair myself. So today I'm going to be showing you my routine on a wash day. So first, obviously, washing and conditioning with something moisturizing. I like All Soft um, by Redken. I also like, right now I'm using Main Tamer by Evo. Um, the first product I like to put in wet hair is called Evo Liquid Rollers, and I kind of just like to rake it through from root to end, making sure I can get in every strand in there. Um, I like Evo because it enhances my natural curl pattern, and it also seals the cuticle, cuticle to prevent um, from moisture loss and reduces frizz. So for my second product, I like to layer on um, Total Recoil, also by Evo. Um, I kind of just scrunch that in. Um, it, it has a little bit of a stronger hold, and it's uh, the hold lasts all day long. Um, it also seals the, cut the cuticles, so lots of good hold in there for the curls and to tame that frizz, which is one of the biggest things I hear, is that people have issues with frizz, so... Great hold. I like to start diffusing at the root because if you think about where the way water travels, it travels downwards. So I like to start at the root first and that's going to give you the most volume. Once you start feeling your root a little bit drier, you can start working at the ends and kind of push it up without rubbing as much because that's just going to create frizz. So we're just going to... For me personally, I don't like to diffuse to 100 because I feel like that creates too much frizz, but some people do it differently. But for me, I don't like to diffuse to 100. I like to let it air dry a bit at the end. Kind of just gives it more definition, I guess. So when it's like this, that's when I don't touch it. I leave it alone. And then it gets to a point where it's kind of like, I don't want to say crunchy, but it is crunchy. And you can scrunch that up. I kind of, Wait until it's 100% dry, otherwise I don't touch it until then. And then when it is 100%, you can kind of give it a scratch at the root, scrunch all that crunch out, and then you should have nice, defined curls. Hey everyone, just here to show you um, my hair when it gets to the point of dry where I can shake it out and I'll show you the results for after. So right now it's like kind of got a little bit of a crunch to it. Some people don't like that, but I do because it keeps my curls more defined. Okay, so I'll just shake it out for you and show you what it looks like after. I'm kind of just scrunching, giving it a scratch at the root. And there you go. I will call that ready for the day.